All right, I'm gonna give you a tour of the uh, four by four fruiting chamber. I know I showed you before, but we're really getting some mushrooms popping in here now. I'm gonna show you guys coming on in. There's some blue mushrooms really pinned in here. These ones didn't go outside the pen, they stayed in here. Just removed some plastic so we can get these pins popping and uh, let that get out of the way. We also have some slits cut here and here, but they haven't produced any pins. So for that one, we cut that out, get some pins out of there. For this one, we actually took it outside in the cold, and I let it set for 24 hours to get a cold night because it hadn't pinned yet. And uh, that seems to produce some pinning here and here for the blue mushrooms, blue oyster mushrooms. Pink oysters blooming like crazy, loving the high humidity, popping everywhere first flush. Boom, I just took that whole top off because there were so many pins, I didn't want them to abort. I was like, let's see what happens with this high humidity. So we're really just letting that go. See how many we can get off of that. And uh, turn around here. Second second harvest of lion's mane for these two. First harvest for these, haven't cut the bag yet, but I'm gonna cut the top here probably tomorrow. And, uh, oh, second flush of lion's mane here. These are gold oysters, haven't fruited yet. Should be any uh, real soon now. Let's go ahead and move this. See it's 61 degrees, 86% humidity. Got the black rishi back here waiting to fruit any day now. Probably gonna start pinning. We'll see though. I don't wanna you know, get ahead of myself. So we got the king oysters here on the back row. Boom, pinning. Nice big giant pins. Got the top of that bag's been open to induce pinning. And uh, got both of these popping off. So more and more coming to you. Sterilizer should be here tonight, the big 41 quart, so we can really get this popping. But I plan to mimic this same tent setup. I found that keeping it under 90% humidity is really preventing the pulling up of, a, of excess moisture. So 85, 86% is really working for me. You know, it says it's at 96% right now because the thing's popping. But keeping it a little bit lower has really helped me keep from too much humidity pulling. But I get in here with a shark vac mop and clean it almost every day, every other day. I pull the shelves away. Wiped on the walls. That's why I like these shelves. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.